Hey guys, welcome back to Brunette Confessions. This is the first video of the year, 2020, and I thought it would be a good idea to make the first video a tour of my new apartment. My lease ended for my other apartment back in November, so I've been living here for like two months, and I am loving it. So I want to take you guys around the room because it's a studio apartment and you know just show it to you guys i hope my hand is steady in this video i actually had like a little um selfie stick but i still think my hand is like moving so it might not be that steady but whatever so before we get started i do want to say that i at first i did not want a studio apartment for some reason i just felt like it was weird to have like everything together and if i were like to cook something i felt like my clothes or my bed or my sheets were gonna smell like the food that i was cooking since the kitchen is like right there and yes yeah, so i was really iffy about, about, about it but then rent was very expensive in the area and there wasn't much of one bedrooms like available to rent for some reason and if they were it was like way too expensive out of my budget so i ended up getting the studio and i absolutely love it so let's jump to it i'm gonna take you guys around i also want to mention before i start that i am shooting this video on my iphone because last time that i set up my lights with my microphone my camera all I got in the comments were complaints saying, why are you so far away? Why is everything so far away? Why is it so dark? So now I'm going to be all up on your entrance right here. Boom, lock. Am I the only one who like when you lock, even when I'm leaving, I check this like a bunch of times. I feel like one day I'm going to, you know, break the lock. Am I the only one? I don't think so. Okay. So when you walk in, this is what you see. I am out of breath. So this is what you see. Another thing I was very iffy about was carpet. By the way, that stain was there when I got here. So whatever, I can't do anything about that. I will put a big rug here, but I don't have time for that. And I don't want to spend money on it. So I was very iffy about carpet. But now I have to clean less. So I'm very happy about it. So over here, you have the kitchen. Here's my fridge. I'm not gonna open it because it's pretty empty. It's just my meals in there. Right here, we got a toaster. These are just coffee pods that came with my Nespresso, which has been so good to me. I haven't bought more coffee pods. I have to go buy, but I did test out a few. Amazing. This is my air fryer, which I don't use that much anymore because I don't cook anymore. I buy meal plans. Here it is. Da -da -da -da. There's, I'm going to just get close to that because, you know, it's a hot mess. Water bottle, whatever. You guys get the point. To this side, that, that's like a little air, like a little spray thing that smells good. Just, you know, want to smell good. Bananas. Why am I so out of breath? My Ninja pre-workout, which is empty. Some gummies. That was a gift. And <laughs> Bill's adulting and my keys. Okay. So then over here, we have my little dining area and my vacuum. Now you ask, why is it there, Jennifer? It's there because I don't know where to put it. So for now, it's going to stay there. Let me get you to show you guys this angle. So I had this, of course, my furniture's from my old apartment. Um, so it's the chairs from Dorado. This is from Ikea. This is um, all the pieces are from Michael's very expensive to put together i should have just bought something done whatever and then this frame i ended up putting that frame there because there was already a hook on the wall so hmm, might as well put it there and then over here this is my living room area and my rack which i just keep there like my gym stuff and i keep um like jackets that i use for work or something so those are my leg weights so here you have this table and my coffee table, they're from Target. That was a gift, my rug, I don't know where it's from. Um, this console table is from Ikea. Little decorations from Amazon, some cute pictures there. I forgot where this is from. I think this is from Home Goods. These little orchids are actually real. They are so cute and so tiny. This was actually a gift 
last week I went um with a photographer for my job to do a story at the Green Market in West Palm Beach. And then one of the vendors gifted me with this little orchid and it's so cute. <laughs> and then here's my TV. Cables are just hanging because I haven't had a chance to do a little, put the little thing, the little white thing that you can like put them inside, whatever, it's staying like that. Here are my bamboo plants, they are real. Here is my couch, that's from Ikea. Pillows are from Home Goods. The white ones I think are from Macy's. And then this is the view to the back. We're gonna get to that section in a second. Um, let me finish off from this section right here. And let me show you guys from this angle so you guys can see. This apartment is actually more like a style, um, like a loft type of style. Is that the right word for it? This is the roof. I actually liked it. It's very industrial. I think that's the right word for it. Industrial. When I first saw this apartment and I wanted to move in, um, I had an idea of putting this wall, like wall art and getting creative with it and just hang pictures and just like hang stuff since it's like such a high ceiling. But then once I was moving from my other apartment to this one and I saw how much I had to pack and how many boxes I had, I was like, there's no way I'm going to keep buying decorations, buying crap to put on the walls. It's just too much. And in my in the industry I'm in and my job, like I'm constantly going to be either moving because of the job opportunities or because I want, you know, cheaper rent. <laughs> so I'm basically living off like out of a backpack so I can't be having too much stuff that i have to be moving around constantly with so yeah no decor no more decorations for me and this little lamp is from well not little because it's big this is from target is it yeah from target and i actually bought like the smart the smart light bulbs for it so i at night i make it like pink and make it really cool i actually want to get a clip to show you guys change the living room lights to green Hey Google, change the living room lights to red. Hey Google, change the living room lights to pink. So this, I had it from my old apartment. Um, These I got it from like a party. Oh my God, and this, these three decorations right here. These were actually from Halloween. And then I decided to just like leave it there year round because I feel like it just fits good with my personality. I'm a Halloween baby. Gotta have my spell book, you know. And I just thought it was so cute. So yeah, it's gonna stay there forever. And then this is my little Google Home. Shout out to Spotify. Got it for the free. And this is a little plant. I think it's from Home Goods. I don't remember. So I just stuck it there. Now let's go to this section right here. Also, very embarrassing before I forget. Take a look at these curtains. <laughs> I know, oh my God, I almost fell back. Guys, I know that they have these curtains, like, I I don't know if it's, I think, I forgot how many feet this is. Is it 10 feet, probably 10 feet, I'm, I don't know. I know that they have long curtains for this type of window, balcony doors, but they're expensive. And I feel like I would spend the money would I spend the money, Jennifer? I don't know if I'll spend the money or not. I know they're expensive. And I just feel like in the meantime, I'll just use little short ones that I have for, that I had from my room back in Miami. And I needed to, you know, hide the light a little bit because in the morning it was just way too bright. It'll wake me up way too early. So these have been working fine for now. And for now, they're going to stay like that. Okay, okay. And then the other ones are normal. <laughs> that was old. I had those in my other room, the velvet ones, which I love. And these are from, I think these were from Target. Those fit good. And then my big mirror, which I had it back in my other apartment from Dorado. Love this mirror. And then here is my lights, my nightstand. All of this is Dorado. All this furniture is Dorado. My bed is very simple. I haven't bought it, um, what you, like uh, pillows for decorations, whatever. I haven't bought that because, I don't know, like I just... I, won't, I don't want to say I haven't had the time for it, but it hasn't been, like, the first thing on my mind. And, you know, more things to carry when I have to move. No, thank you. It's staying like that. Over here is my little vanity. 
Um, this is my my little um, box with makeup because I won't constantly take it with me to Miami. So I just like keep it all in there. My bag for work, laptop, whatever. So as you see, all of this is like pretty empty because all my makeup is in there. And then here's have some necklaces, but most of my jewelry, I actually have it inside my luggage that I take with me to Miami. So yeah, and then here I have some shoes. A lot of shoes are missing because I have it in Miami. And then here I have this little stand, purses um, there. But I have like my most used purses in my luggage for Miami. So over here I have some perfume. This is my watch. Some night lights or whatever. So actually let me zoom into this side. I have here my fan. This is a little hallway. Over here this is my, this is my laundry. Some cleaning equipment, tools, whatever it is. Over here to this side is my closet. Yup, I had to say goodbye to my walk-in closet. Did it hurt? Yes, it did. But I am actually loving this apartment more, so I am happy about it. There's my luggage. Here's some shoes. Sorry if it's messy. I barely have clothes here because it's just work stuff. Over here, I have like another closet of some sort. Since I don't have like a dresser anywhere to put my clothes any drawers i keep it usually here these are just some bags whenever i have to take stuff home on to miami here are some clothes these are usually these are like mostly my gym stuff and yeah gym stuff so i keep some blankets some towels here and since i don't have nowhere to put my equipment to film it's all in here my ring light tripod yep all that good stuff Right here, I don't have to open it. This is just like the air conditioning. And then this is the entrance to my bathroom. As you see, it is a clear shower curtain because I'm not trying to get killed while I'm showering. <laughs> I feel like it's always been a fear of mine in a bathroom getting killed while I'm showering. So I decided to get it just like clear so I can have a view of my room or, you know, Nobody catches me by surprise, you know, I gotta be aware at all times. So then here is my little sink section, toilet, dirty clothes, as pajamas, towel. That's my black African soap in case you're wondering what that black block is. And then, so right here we have my cripping, little wave things, whatever you call it, for my hair. Lower iron hairbrush. And then this is so convenient. I actually found this from watching a apartment tour of some other blogger there a while back. And I loved it. That was super convenient. So I bought it. It's from Amazon. I will try to find it and link it down below for you guys. So here I keep all my skincare. Um, all my my stuff, you know. I got cream, perfume, perfume. Okay, and yeah, my skincare stuff. Um, and then you guys know the rest. All right. There are some hair accessories and that's about it. I don't know why I'm so out of breath today. I haven't eaten anything. I think that's my problem. So, yep, guys. That's it for my apartment tour. Let me give you guys an, this little view over here. I absolutely love it. I think if you're someone who, well, girl or guy, whatever, living alone, it's just so convenient. It's a smaller space for cleaning, for everything. And it's just nice. I don't know. Like, I really, really, really like it. All right, guys, that is all for my apartment tour. I got to go get the ball rolling. Got to eat. Got to go to work right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys liked something and you want to know where I got it, just let me know. Contact me down below in my comments or find me on social media. I will help you out. I'll find the link and I will let you know. So that's all for now, guys. See you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe and like. See ya.